Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. Okay, so the latest tennis casualty now of the coronavirus is the Labor Cup, which is gonna be postponed an entire year. Organizers announced new dates for the Boston event set now for September 24th through the 26th of 2021. At this point, Roland Garros has rescheduled for September and the US Open is holding off until June to make a final decision about that event. So what will pro tennis look like in a post-coronavirus age? The Italian Tennis Federation president argues that tennis is the safest sport because it is a non-contact sport. So it's in keeping with social distancing, at least for the players. A 78 foot long court, players sitting apart from each other on the changeovers, and the game could eliminate ball kids and lines people, just have the players pick up their own balls and call their own lines with maybe the help of Hawkeye. The game could increase safety and decrease the chances of any close contact. The Italian tennis chief also proposes moving the Rome Masters, which is traditionally played on red clay in May, to either September or October after Roland Garros. Plan B, transform Rome to an indoor event played on a fast court and staged in Milan or maybe Turin in November or December. Northern Italy was of course hit very hard by the coronavirus and the Italian tennis chief believes it might be fitting for a tennis rebirth in that region that has suffered so much death due to COVID-19. The Italian Federation has also offered to host the ATP finals if London's O2 arena is unavailable due to the virus. Of course, all of this is contingent on government officials approving the return of pro sport. So if that happens, we could have a back-loaded calendar with lots of tournaments coming late in the fall. We asked USTA CEO Mike Dows if the USTA supports the idea. Here's what he told us. You know, I'm just a big fan of being entrepreneurs and doing what we can to keep the pro tennis, go pro tennis going. Again, all with the qualification that it has to be 100% safe for all those involved. And that uh, means, you know, the players, the coaches, the linesmen, umpires, physios, and of course the fans. So any way pro tennis can be played safely, we're, we're for it uh, in whatever package that may be delivered in. Dows projects a lot of pain ahead of the tennis industry in the short term, but also points to what might be a silver lining long term. Tennis is the perfect social distancing sport and will be a safe and healthy sport and perhaps a stress reliever for people all over the world as the COVID curve flattens. So what about you? Would you support backloading the calendar and even moving some traditional outdoor tournaments like maybe Rome or Cincinnati, even the US Open for that matter, to indoor status later in the year if it's safe? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you already bought a labor ticket, by the way, for Boston, we have good news because all tickets purchased for the 2020 Labor Cup will be valid for the 2021 rescheduled dates. Thanks for watching, everybody. Stay safe and stay sane. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.